Hi, so I'm going to show you how to set up a class notebook. So in every class team, so in this case demo, is linked with a class notebook, which is a digital notebook. And to create one, first I press here, set up a notebook, and I'm going to start with a blank notebook. So here they have four compartments in the notebook the collaboration space content library teacher only session and student notebooks so teacher only session and student notebooks are all private space press next so these are the students notebook and here they have four folders so let's say i'm going to add another session and I'm going to call this cell learning and then create and it will take a little while to set up the class notebook it depends on the size of the class so the digital class notebook is now ready to use and we have complete control over how we want to organize the notebook in terms of the um, content so I'm going to keep the welcome page and all the frequency asked question but let's look at the collaboration space now here this is all by default so this is just like an introduction this is the space where multiple people can edit a document at the same time so let's say I'm going to add a page under the collaboration session and I'm going to call this lesson one and this is the place where all the students can engage with each other during the lesson then we've move on using the content library is helpful if teachers want to share the materials with other students so I can add a page here under the content library. Let's say I'm going to insert a file as an attachment and it's a PDF file. So student can copy anything from here to the notebook. So teacher only session is a private space for teachers. So only teachers can see the material in this session, but they can also use it to distribute material to the rest of the class. So let me demonstrate how this can be done. So let's say I'm going to add a page and I'm going to call this lesson one. And I'm going to insert an attachment so let's say a class schedule so no one can see the class schedule until I distribute that to the class the way to do this is if I go up to the ribbon and go to class note and then distribute page So I just want to distribute this to, so go to distribute page, right, to the whole class. So I'm going to distribute this PDF file to the whole class. As you know, I have created five folders um, in the student notebook. And let's say I'm going to put this under handout. So I'm going to click on handout and then distribute so the distribution is done so let's check the student folder right I only have one student here and I would expect the class schedule be saved under handouts as you can see here's the class schedule so here um, is how you want to do this distribution 
You can even do a cross notebook distribution as well, notebook from a different class. And you can also distribute new session or copy the all the material from existing content library to another content library from a different class. And you can also review student work as well and also to manage the notebook as well. So um, you can edit the session, you can add session if you want, but you cannot delete session from, um, from here. You can only do this if you logged in from Microsoft Office and open the class notebook app, then you can delete student notebook session. And here you can lock the collaboration space after you finish the lesson so other students cannot do any more editing. And here finally is the link. So students can use the link to get to the notebook directly as well, if you prefer to do it that way. So that will be the end of the video.